Next week marks five months on the job for Honolulu Mayor Rick Blangiardi. Today, he sat down with Howard Dushevsky to give an update on the issues he's dealing with at Honolulu Hale. I started by asking the longtime former television executive if running the city and county of Honolulu was what he expected. The challenges couldn't be any greater. I mean, everything's been exacerbated by COVID, and we can't talk about priorities without talking about economic recovery, but all of the other issues are still there. He says the pandemic and all issues related to it has been priority number one. We really do want to stay focused on leaning into the hard stuff, which was right there. I mean, you know, as I saw, I'm going to say it again. Whether or not we want to do that, I don't have any legacy projects of mine, economic recovery and anything and everything tied to that. So um, never had a sense of responsibility like this before. And it's, but it's not daunting. Surprisingly, it's very energizing. With more visitors arriving every day and the forecast for summer travel to be close to pre-pandemic levels, he feels positive about the future, but understands the need for balance. You know, we know that tourism is the lifeblood here, but how do we balance this need for more people to come versus, you know, wanting to maintain social order and maintain our trails and our beaches without overcrowding and overburdening our resources? I'm more concerned about that than anything is not subordinating, subordinating if, if you will, uh, for the almighty dollar, the quality of life that people who live here, work here, and sacrifice to stay here, you know, they shouldn't have to sacrifice more. On Oahu's reopening tier system, Blangiardi says he understands the governor's position on public health and safety and says it's time to look forward. We're literally days away from moving into tier four. We've now shifted the metrics from case counts and positivity levels to vaccinations. So we're in a very different place than people had anticipated. And so all we're trying to do is be relevant with that and, and what makes sense all the same time keeping public health, good public health as our priority. I also asked the mayor beyond the pandemic looking forward, what are the greatest opportunities and the greatest challenges for himself and for the county? He says rail and homelessness are the next two biggest issues that need to be addressed. We've been in the business right now of putting together a really uh, comprehensive plan. Uh, we're still very much a work in progress, but going to the FDA, getting some clarity, clarity we can then relate back to the public about expectations is going to be a really important part. Homeless situation we've been working on since we got in here, as I think I said earlier, it was one of my major reasons for wanting to run for office. But we're setting up our core outreach services where the police are no longer going to be the tip of the spear. It's going to be providing social services. We recognize the need that needs to become greater. Howard Dushevsky, KHON 2 News, working for Hawaii.